Surrey Hills Live for like what the eleventh time. Welcome everyone in Surrey Hills and right around the world tonight. It's like an incredibly, crazily huge show. Uh, we have a massive, um, huge multi-band show. It's amazing, uh, and we're going to start off with with Cody Dillon. Um, what's been happening, Rob? Oh, we don't actually have a camera on you, do we? <laughs> uh, how we? Oh, there we go. We do. And uh, how are yeah, you, sir? I'm very well. I'm very well. It's been a big day. We've been sound checking since uh, since two o'clock. Two o'clock. Uh, two o'clock. We've been here for for, for, for many Amazing. an hour. But it's sounding incredible. Um, we are starting off with Cody Dillon, and then we have Tom Hess playing with Ruben Alexander. Then we have the entire, the complete Liz Martin band, um, and then we're finishing it off with a rock and roll set by. One and only Nick Daly. It's huge. Tonight is massive. Uh, turn the speakers up, kick back, and, uh, and just live music is here uh, in wherever you are. So enjoy. Enjoy the night. Uh, We've yeah. also got a few little special treats. Uh, Kathy Lou is, mm -hmm. is our guest again this evening, which is super exciting as always. Always. And also you and I have spent a lot of time in the neighborhood this week because of course it's starting to reopen again. So mm -hmm. we did a little bit of a tour down to some of our favorite uh, local businesses, uh, including Four Pines. And th the dude from Four Pines was just here. He just gave us this whole like case of beer. It was like amazing. Like. Thank, Thank you, you dudes. Paul um, amazing. But yeah, so you get to see our journey around the neighborhood. But um, oh my God, we don't want to crap on too much because look, look who's right we've, there. We've got a lot of, of music to get through tonight. We've got a lot of music to get through. And, 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 and we have the amazing Mr. Cody Dillon. How are you, sir? I'm good, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks What's been happening? Me. I'm happy to be back. Uh, yeah, looking forward to singing. Hello, everyone. Hi, Cody. Woo! 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 Um, now, first song. One of my favorites of yours. What is it? Why did you choose to start with this song today? I think just uh, reflecting the mood, what's happening in the world this week, in the States, with the death of George Floyd. Um, and it seems a lot of uh, people listening here and speaking and uh, listening to Aboriginal people. Most importantly, it's a song called Pemawoy, an old song of mine about the resistance fighter, famous resistance fighter from here on Gadigal country. He was a Bidigal man, I think. Your nation, so yeah, I think it's important that I sing this song. It's one of my favorites. Um, it's definitely one of my favorites. I met someone recently who had, a, had two people who had a, a song about Pemelway. One was Marlene Cummins, she's an amazing person, has a show on Koori Radio. Check it out, Marlou's Blues. Um, yeah, we were able to swap out Pemelway songs, and that was a pretty great moment. There's a sound issue here. <laughs> I'm just, just gonna get on with it. Yeah, Joe, man, amazing. Let's hear it. Thank you, buddy.
tracking down this pebble wood It's like hunting down a ghost And the hair on my neck stands on edge Every time I hear a crow And around Sydney town stories are spreading That his only weapon is fire And the bullets don't kill him Wow, it's great to have you back, Cody. Oh, yeah. It's been a while, like I'm thinking like at least two weeks, right? <laughs> <laughs> What's been happening? I'm a resident. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to pick up with another one. Cool. Beautiful. Similar theme, but where, you know, the story of colonization is fairly uh, similar everywhere. Um, this is a song about a cavalry soldier um, wanting to flee the army, I guess, and cross the border into Mexico not happy with the political situation in his own country with his own army. So it, it seemed fitting to sing this song as well, given the current climate. Thank you. 
like a bear sucks. Police brutality sucks. Damn it does. Right. It's scary times in the world Black right and now. Black Aboriginal lives matter. Uh, absolutely. Um, he he right. he he. Now, I'm going to move on to a song from my own culture. It's called Alcohol. <laughs> Alcohol. I need a harmonica. The guitar sounding sweet, man. Thank you. The, I love the this trusty guitar. old Gibson. The trusty old Gibson. This was the replacement, if you remember. The first oh. one. I was hoping you would tell that story. <laughs> you don't have to tell the whole story. Nah. Just but it is related to the song, though, I think. Losing a guitar in a park. <laughs> Waking up and your guitar is gone. Oof. Ouch. It involves whiskey. Good segue into this song. Yes. Um, there's a lot of songs about whiskey, bluegrass-type blues songs. A lot of songs about cocaine, but I realise that I, I've never heard one about alcohol. Australia is swimming in this stuff. I love it. <laughs> and especially now, right, uh, Rob, I mean, things are, uh, you know, slowly getting back to normal. I mean, you and I have uh, really taken advantage of this last week of uh, pubs um, getting... Have we? Getting back. Well, I yeah. think so. I mean, we, what, we've been out like twice this week already. Oh, uh, yeah. It's like it's Thursday. I feel like it should be, uh, I don't 
don't know, Friday. Pub night. <laughs> yeah, pubs are open. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's, it's great. It's, so, it's good. Uh, and, you yeah, know, bring I think it soon on, we'll, we'll have, we'll have more, some music in pubs. <laughs> Hopefully, <laughs> as Hopefully, well. that's the next step. Yeah. So, alcohol, Cody. Yes, here's an yes. Australian song called Alcohol. Let's do it. Incredible. I think that's the best version I've heard of that song. Oh, really? Yeah, that yeah. was super, super sweet. That was Thank a super you. sweet rendition it of it. It sounds gorgeous, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Time yeah. for one more. Like. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah. All right. Please. Yeah. What do you what do you, what do you feel like playing? I'm gonna play Southside. I was gonna request oh, that. the Southside yes. of Town. Yeah. Cody, do you remember this is the track that like this was like the first night we were shooting for Surrey Hills Live at the Shakespeare. Yes. And you did this track and it was absolutely electric and. <laughs> And do you remember that shot we got? There was this guy as you were playing that track, like on some other dude's shoulders, trying to climb a lamppost to get yeah. under the awning of the Surrey Hills Live, and the trams were going past, and the rain was there, and there were the dogs, and it was like such a beautiful Surrey Hills moment. And man, it brings me, takes me back. <laughs> yeah, that was that was that was my last time in a pub as well. It's amazing. Apart from all the pubs we went to this week. Oh yeah, aside from the three previous, nights we spent comments. going out to pubs this week, yeah, Rob, yeah, yeah. which we've got, which Sorry, we're going to yeah. do a segment on later. Fact on, checking, so. um, yeah, <laughs> fact checking. Thanks, dude. <laughs> um, tell us, tell us, Code Man, what's this song about? It's 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 a song about South Sydney. It's a song about um, actually just imagine going to a wedding in North Sydney on the north side of town and just wanting to get back to the south side of town. Right. 
Nothing, Get me out of the wrong with North <laughs> Sydney. It's um, fucking poison it's up just here. Just about <laughs> where I live. Where you are. Where I've always lived. Yeah. 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 It's a song about um, the southern suburbs. Redford, for yeah. example. Surrey Hills, where we are. So yeah, this is a song called um, South Side of Town. Great news. I wrote it for Bruce Springsteen. <laughs> oh, the boss. <laughs> Stick around if you're watching for the next musicians coming up. Tom Hess, we've got the Liz Martin band. So much. Um, who else have we got tonight? Mick Daly. Oh, Mick, Mick Daly. Daly. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, a, he's a hero of mine. He's great. Yeah, um, it's amazing. Stick around. They're all awesome. Mate, that was awesome. Thank you, Cody. <laughs> and uh, yes.
Yes, we've got, we've got some, some, some of the musicians in the room digging, digging that set and some up in the green room up, upstairs to be, to be socially, socially distanced, obviously. Cody, you really got into that last song. I saw you so smiling. That's my party uh, song. Yeah, I saw you just yeah, <laughs> like having a little laugh to yourself at that one. That was great. Thank you. Thanks, Good sorry, to see. Live. Thanks Good for having Good to us. see, man. Thank you for coming in. It's much appreciated. <laughs> oh, man, it is a huge night here. It's, it's almost like a finale kind of a night. Uh, it's huge. We got the next, uh, we got Tom Hesp in the house. Um, but, you know, it, like when we started this whole Surrey Hills Live business downstairs here in the basement, you know, it was because uh, we were just heading into the lockdown and uh, there was really nothing else to do. I was going to say nothing else to do on Thursday night, but there was nothing else to do on any night. And we thought, why not start our own little thing in the basement? But what's been amazing this week is that we're starting to see, you know, the world come back. And Rob and I caught up Saturday morning. We walked around our neighborhood and, um, you know, it was a beautiful winter's morning. And uh, you just are struck by, like, everything we missed. Uh, here's a little thing we, we're going to run right now, which is our little journey into one of our favorite cafes. It's like a block from Rob's house. It's a beautiful, beautiful cafe. Uh, incredible, uh, uh, like food, coffee, whatever you need. Uh, we're going to cut to that and we're going to come back with Tom Hesp and a bunch of other special guests. So check it out, guys. Uh, hey, so um, what's the morning been like? Have you been busy? Oh, it's been it's been busy, yeah. It's yeah. um it's amazing. We uh, we've experienced amazing community support. Um, I love this cafe uh, because uh, they serve the best coffee and the best manouche breakfast plates uh, in in the world. And I come here uh, most mornings and say good day to Simon and Lucia, who are my dear friends. Um, and it's just a fast, fantastic experience every time. What's everyone's favourite meal? Oh, look, I think it's the... Well, some days it varies. Today it's uh, the breakfast plate. Um, it's a uh, manouche bread and it's got feta, hummus, house-made pickles, uh, boiled egg, yes, and beautiful roasted cherry tomatoes. Thank you, everybody. We'll see you soon. Thanks, Thanks. Rob. Coffee's see you guys. Yeah. Look who it is. Everyone's Hi. here. Surprise, surprise. Hello. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? Great, great, great. That's good. What are you up to? Uh, I'm off to a brunch. I don't really know what brunch is, so I've got... I made hummus, tzatziki, I can't pronounce that, uh, and char-grilled eggplant. Amazing. That's my idea of heaven. Mm -hmm. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, Cody. Yeah. Yeah, rock on. Surrey Hills Live. <laughs> yeah, Surrey Hills Live is awesome. Thank you. Super fun just to have coffee, right? I know like it's just having coffee, but when you haven't been able to go out for a coffee for months, of course, you guys all know it, it's amazing. Yeah. Um, right now, as you can hear behind me, uh, some, an incredibly special artist, uh, our dear friend Tom Hesp is, is uh, tuning up, checking it out. But look who we found. How Hi, are you, just my from darling? under the couch. Hello. You're like a panther, <laughs> you're like a panther. No, you literally, you've got, what is that? Oh, yeah, I've, got my, I've got my leopard, skin. yes, I've got my leopard skin. So, Kathy, i got a question for you, yeah. right? Um, so, like, uh, lockdown sucked, uh, but we kind of started to get used to it, uh -huh. and now we've all got to go back to work. Uh-huh. Like, what's that, what's the, what is the feel? What's the feel we're getting on this, the on feel, this thing? Um, initially, I didn't want to get back to work. Yeah. But then finally, yesterday, I went out and started shooting again. Woo! And it's nice, you know? bit of sun walking around seeing people but you've got cool things coming up because you just put out you just released a feature film right uh, we just finished post-production yeah finished, so that's great mm. and and you've got other cool stuff that you're shooting you know because mm. you're a you're like an actor 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 comedian actor comedian like kind of social media personality oh, like I a general try, person I try I try <laughs> so tell us what's coming up with you um so we put in um so I've done lots of writing so we've put in some applications for funding which mm -hmm. we, we're still doing you gotta do it it's still doing and in the meantime we're just you know coming up with more ideas Dreaming Amazing. up new dreams. Yeah. yeah. Well, we have so appreciated your contributions to Surrey Hills Live, the, 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 the dating no. stuff. Like, oh my God, like so sad, but so true, so potent, so incredible. It's been very, very cool. No, it's been fun. It's been very yeah. fun. Um, and next week, I, I might have a video for you next week. Ah, another Kathy Lou video. <laughs> I want it, Kathy. I want it, I want it, I want it so, I want it so hard. Um, I want it so good. 
amazing. And Dean, what have you been doing? What have I been doing? Well, doing? like we're, you know, JJ Splice is getting back. Um, you know, we're, 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 we're live streaming, we're, mm. you know, making amazing stuff. Uh, Working with a lot of actors, um, developing movies. Developing movies. You know, yes. I mean, you, you would do what we do, right? Mm -hmm. um, it's amazing. So, no, I just feel very lucky uh, on a Thursday, uh, you know, to be right here with uh, these incredible artists. And you know, I, these guys are sound shaking forever today, and we were just up in the air, and I was like, oh my god, how lucky are we to have these incredible artists? This beautiful sounds coming up the stairwell into the edit suite, and it's gorgeous. And. Um, so much talent. So much talent. So much talent. But I just want to do one final shout out. We've got a couple of other little interesting segs that are coming up. But like, and I know this has almost become a cliche, but like, it's so hard to fund artists in this time. It's so hard to fund this stream. Um, there's a link that Tim's going to put up on the screen right now for our GoFundMe. If you guys mm -hmm. want us to keep on uh, streaming, then please just consider, uh, you know, throwing a buck in for this stream because, uh, you know, Dreams don't come for free, do they, Kathy? Mm. They don't come for free. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, speaking of dreams, in the house, right in front of me, look who it is. Woo! Tom Hess, how Woo! are you, buddy? Woo! Good evening, the world. Oh, look at that. Oh my God. Love that hat, my friend. Yeah, thank you. Look, you look amazing. I've been wearing overalls for the last three wow. months, so it was so good to get dressed up. You're so sharp, you're smoking. <laughs> Woo! Smoking hot. Smoking. Smoking hot. <laughs> hey, so, Tom, we've got a big set for you. No! Oh. Whoa! Oh. Sexy! We've got a bit of fun. We've got, um, so you're going to do a solo yet. song to start with. What's the first song uh, we're going to hear from you tonight? Uh, this song's called Gem. Um, it's an oldie, and it's a duet. But I'm just going to sing it on my own. So. Okay. Duet for one. Duet for one, yes. <laughs> and who's joining you later in your set? Uh, the fabulous Ruben Alexander. Woo! With the lit up drum kit, <laughs> that you'll be seeing a lot of him tonight. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd start off on my own. Woo! Great. To warm myself up. Let's get into it. Uh, Jim. Get out. 
lot of us just want to stick it in Ain't no way to tell Until you begin So sell me your story Blow me a light You so hard Or just hard to I listen But you can't talk anymore If I keep you kissing Come over here Let me hold your hand I'm not afraid of the devil He's just another man He's just another man another man He's just another man He's just another man He's just another man Lovely Alexander. listening. That was beautiful. Really good. Such a good sound, man. Yeah. Gina. So beautiful. So this is the first, the first drum kit uh, that we have had uh, at uh, <gasps> Surrey Hills Live. So this is a very big moment. Ruben Woo! and I have Let's been here since two. Drum kit. Doing the sound. Ruben was kind enough to bring all his microphones, and we were working at it, and it sounds fantastic. Hey, Rob. Uh, how long did it take to sound check the uh, the drums today? Oh, an hour. About an hour, it's, it's, hour, hour it's, and a half. You know what? Because we're not a live music venue, we're just a, like a studio, and it's like it's a drawn out thing. It's a big, it's a big deal. It was you guys a, did so well. It was today. a bit of work, but it's great, and it was fun. I actually, I'm going to ask Ruben a bit later about the uh, the microphones because that was mm. very interesting. To I learned a lot um, from from miking those drums or, 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 or helping Ruben set it up. Anyway. Um, so great to have you here, Ruben. Thank you so much for coming and, and being such a legend setting up. Um, Let's hear it. What are we going to hear, Tom? Uh, it's a song called Legs 11. You can work out what it's all about. <laughs> Strong hide. I've been shopping in my skills, but shooting apples in a barrel don't thrill. Strictly soft call, I can't chew anymore. I'm getting fat, but I ain't getting my fill. Not tonight. It's not tomorrow, too.
in the white Like the boss I was blinded by the light Heads you in baby tails I'm in I'll keep on tossing if it takes me all night I've been working up my will On tequila and them little blue pills Half at a time you're in a couple of nights When they can hurt you then they probably This song was for so Tom good. Jones. Mr. It's Tom Jones, our for Tom Jones? bass player. Well, it's not really for him, but we miss you, Tom Jones. Where we do you? miss Tom. Oh. I, I miss Another Tom, Tom Jones. Yeah, he's a childhood yeah. icon of mine, Tom Jones. But he's it's also a great bass player. My dad was working down in the car. He's what? Tom Jones. What's coming up, Tom? A big, big, big What's voice. Coming up of his. is your life. I think it's maybe a different Tom Jones. This is a I don't know. Did Tom Jones die? Bit of a rock and song, I guess. This is on the Slowdown's first album, first and only album. We're working on the difficult second album. You should try and get the Slowdown's on Surrey Hills Live. What do you reckon? Sure. sure. <laughs> 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 Your fridge is not big enough. <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, anyway, this I recorded this song a million years ago in the basement in 128 Little Everly Street where Rob and I used to live with Cody as well oh. on a four track tape recorder. Oh yes, yeah. I remember that T Tascam, yeah, wasn't it? Oh, I, had, did you, I had a Tascam as well. The <laughs> but anyway, we're gonna have a crack at it. Let's do it. Sounding fantastic. Uh, uh, how's it sounding out in the, the virtual world? The room is the room is amazing. Yeah, it's good. We have got a lot of lot of folks out there in the audience watching. We have a lot of folks in the audience watching and listening. Oh, more importantly, all right, let's do this. Let's do this.
Amazing stuff right there, guys. <laughs> like, Tom, that's beautiful sound, man. Rocking. So beautiful. Yeah, like, we're so, we're, so, we're so spoiled for incredible artists tonight, Rob. Look at that. I can do a Dean point of view of Rob. Oh. Uh, what do I look like? Huh? I don't know. I think he's skip, no, skip wrong way. This uh, way. Oh, hello. Hello. It looks like a conversation um, camera. Conversation camera. Tom, it's sounding amazing, man. Thank you very much. Ruben. Ruben. Ruben sounding Alexander. sounding nice incredible. In the room. Oh man. <laughs> Ruben, Ruben is playing with uh, all three bands tonight. So what's with uh, that like stick the violin uh, the bow. bow through the drum? That's amazing, man. That's incredible. It sounds extraordinary. Let's get a shot on that. That's gorgeous. That's actually how the next song starts. Wow. So. I'm in Wolf wow. Creek, like right now. I'm in a horror movie. It's a beautiful sound. It's so incredible. That's oh, fantastic. That's so, so cool. So delicious. So delicious. Ah, I love guys. that sound. That's amazing. Um, what is what's the next song, Tom? Well, we got one more song. This song is called Stripes. I love it. It's getting pretty pretty smoky in here as well. Stripes. Stripes, what can I say? It's pretty dark. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to explain it, mate. Don't worry. <laughs> um, let's hear it. Let's get into yeah. it. Thank you so much for coming in, Tom. Pleasure. Thomas Thank Hesp, uh, a partner in crime and music for trees as well. We've been working together for 12 years. We've planted over 100,000 trees through music as well. Something to be proud of. You may. Yeah. You, well, you... actually, I got on my Facebook feed here last a couple of weeks ago that it was nine years since we did the. Jane Goodall was here with us. Ah, Jane Goodall. Goodall. Yeah, Jane Dr. Goodall. Jane Goodall. She's lovely. Yeah, I've worked with Jane. I worked with Dr. Jane. Did a Jane. Music for Trees show, a couple of shows at the Red Rattler and Camelot. Well, yeah. That was an amazing night. It was an amazing night. night. Yeah, I can't believe that was nine years ago. Liz didn't play with us, but Jack Amity did. Yeah. Who else played? There was well, a bunch of people did, but. Oh man, nine years, hey? Well. More of it, more of it, I say. And uh, thank you again for coming in to Surrey Hills Live and uh, sharing your talent with us tonight. It's a real pleasure to have you here. So. My talent is your talent. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's, uh, let's hear Stripes. Thanks hey? to you guys as well. Thanks to J JJ Splice, thanks to Music for Trees, thanks to Surrey Hills Live, thanks to, well, the 
you know, Sydney City Council first started it off in the first place. That's it. That's right. Thanks cool. to the people out there for listening and watching.
Beautiful guys, that's incredible. Thank you very much. What an incredible sound. Tom Hesp. What an incredible Ruben sound. Thank you so much, oh Tom wow. Hesp and, Tom and Ruben for that. Wow, what a set. That's insanely Which we didn't have to, to let you go. First gig for so long, far out. <laughs> that was incredible. How does it feel? 
Well, I've got a captive audience. So. <laughs> <laughs> Feels great, actually. I was really nervous tonight because I, you know, Mick and Liz and Cody and you and all my musician musicians heroes are here tonight, but they're all upstairs, so they can't see me. <laughs> you guys can't see me, can you? <laughs> no, it's a, it's it's a it's a stellar lineup tonight. It's 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 my favourite. This is a big night for us. It's our first band night. I wanted to invite uh, my my favourite. Uh, songwriters and friends in here uh, for this. So thank you for being a part of that, Thomas Hesp. Yeah, thank you very much. Music Woo! Tree, Sorry Hills Live. Yeah, man. Thank you, dude. We have Liz Martin. So, so awesome that you could come back and it's like a full circle moment and we'll see you at the Shakespeare. Yeah, it's <laughs> so, <back>. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Buddy, amazing. So we got Liz Martin, not just Liz Martin, but Liz Martin Band. Obviously, we've had the extreme pleasure of Liz Martin uh, here before. Uh, with um, with Michael and it was just yeah. so serene and beautiful and one of the most beautiful musical moments actually of my life. I'm not actually joking about that. It was incredible. So um, we've got the full Liz Martin band. We have and the whole band. I'm super excited. We're going to have a chat with Liz uh, in just a sec while you guys are setting up. Um, but we also want to just really give a big shout out to the enormously uh, like important work that like the local venues have been doing in Surrey Hills. It's been such a shit time for anyone who runs a food and beverage business anywhere in the world. Uh, but the, the troopers in Surrey Hills, the local pubs, uh, it's just been this incredible show of resilience and strength uh, we need our pubs in, in Surrey Hills. This is how we connect as a community. This is how we come together and we celebrate the things that, that make us human beings. Uh, so this week when they lifted the restrictions uh, to, uh, from, from 10 people to allow 50 people into local pubs, it really was a very special moment in the culture of Surrey Hills. Uh, and, and Rob, you and I didn't waste any time Night number one, my friend. We were out there, weren't we? We, we? we did get nominated for the Community Spirit Award for Time Out. We I don't did. Know if you know that. It's, it's all did. about the community for us. So we did want to get out there and show our support of our friends at our venues. Uh, yeah, and it was a fantastic night. I think did we, did we took a camera with us too, didn't we? we I, I, you know, I'm try, funny. I had to remember what we, what we did. <laughs> but no, no, I'm just joking. Of course not. Drink responsibly. Yeah, we did, of course. We, we went took to a your camera local. With... We started at, at, your, at your local, the Carrington, and we ended up at the clock, and then we ended up at the Trinity, and then we ended up at the Bar Cleveland. We did quite the crawl. So uh, maybe we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get a little that. glimpse at that, yeah. and uh, we'll let Liz, uh, Liz, the Liz Martin band set up, and uh, we'll see you guys in a couple of minutes. And uh, without further ado... Here's the Dean and Rob Surrey Hills pub crawl. <laughs> oh, delicious nectar of the gods. Uh, it is Monday and uh, pubs, uh, the institutions where people come together and gather and joyously share stories are open again. And we are here at the Carrington and I'm about to sign my name uh, in the book here just to say that I've been here just in case. But Dean and I are here and we are going to sign our names and have a beer and have a meal um, and then maybe go for a little adventure around Surrey Hills to see what's going on, who's about, what pubs are open. We're going to chat to some of the bartenders uh, and uh, and staff to see how they're feeling about all of this. So, hooray! What's it like having pubs back in Surrey? Uh, amazing. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Uh, it's just the best thing ever. This beer is delicious. Pub is life to me. So, without the pub, I don't have much going on in my life. So, thank goodness for the pub. I now have my life restored. How's it feel to be working at a pub again? Uh, it's, it's pretty crazy. I don't know, it's, it's strange but good. Well, it's, you know, everyone's had the time off. It's all a bit rusty coming back to it again, but it's been pretty smooth today, pretty smooth. Everyone's very understanding about the new rules and everything. So. I preferred being out of pubs and at home because I was getting paid to not work. <laughs> um, so I don't know if that's what you're, if that sort of fits the narrative that you're creating. Fabulous. Fabulous, darling. Oh my god, that's amazing. Oh. Genius. What is your oh, word? Just amazing. Stunning. Surrey Hills Live. Mm -hmm. 
It's great to be out. Meet new people, being filmed without knowing. Like it's awesome. I'm sick of being on Zoom. I'm sick of it. Surrey Hills Live. 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 Oh, that was a fun that was night, amazing. Kathy. And those shots at the end, did they make the cut? They were just water. We didn't really do <laughs> shots did on a Monday oh, really? night. Who would do shots on a Monday night? Not me, No, Kathy. no, of course not. You're, you're, not, never you're, a, you're a non-drinker. I'm a non-drinker. So you, you can't relate. Uh, it's it's an amazing night uh, tonight in Surrey Hills Live. And what's so cool is that we've actually tonight been able to get uh, a band in How the studio. Happen? Because mm -hmm. before it was impossible because the, you know, very strict social distancing, mm -hmm. uh, not that the, there's no social distancing now, there still is obviously. It's something that's very front of mind but just to see a band is so cool isn't it it was like i just came down when they were like doing sound checks i'm like oh my god wow it's like a band it's you like know a party. what as well i just feel like um it's been such a surreal oh, moment and we're so fortunate because we haven't had to go through mm. the intense lockdown that european countries have done yeah. and we certainly don't have to contest with what america's going through mm. with COVID and now with this mm. awful 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 heartbreaking situation that's yeah. in america um, but nonetheless, we can still have petty bitch bitches and petty gripes about like shit that we love and hate about the lockdown. And I've been feeling so grateful for so many things that I took for granted. Uh, number one being pubs. What's something that you used to take for granted that you now are, are like, oh my God, it's amazing that we have oh, this back. Um, cafes, I miss going to my cafes. Yeah. I miss my morning journal. Yeah, yeah. I miss just driving around. Yeah. You know what I miss is actually just like staring into a crowd of strangers and just like looking, like people watching, looking at people going like, what's your story? You look like really interesting. Like, and just, I have this weird like obsession where I'm just like, I try to like build a backstory around a person and it's probably completely absurd, but I just love looking at random strangers. Mm -hmm. Does that sound creepy? Maybe it sounds creepy, but just interacting with human beings. And then bumping into them. <laughs> I know, that's the other thing as well. Like the other day, like what was it yesterday? I was at the sandwich shop, uh, the Rutland Street sandwich shop, beautiful. And, and who was there right uh, next to the queue? It was me. I bumped, it was in, you. I bumped into Dean. <laughs> I bumped into Dean. Bumping into people. That was Bumping pretty good. into people. Yeah, it's just, oh. no, that's pretty good. It is amazing. It is amazing. Well, we are, are coming to you at a very interesting time in uh, in world history. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I uh, obviously um, a lot of solidarity with. Um, what's happening in America yeah. um, and Black Lives Matter, uh, you know, and disturbing as well to see, uh, you know, an incident yesterday right in our neighborhood, a block away in, in, in Ward Park that really needs to be investigated, that really Ooh. needs to be looked into. Um, this is not a political show, um, but, you know, music and, and, and politics and life, they are interrelated. Mm -hmm. uh, as we can see, everyone's setting up. Let's get a little wide shot there. We can see the setup that's going yeah, into this uh, this thing. And look at that. This is yeah. dedicated musicians, you know, um, with such a potent perspective on life. Every track that we're hearing tonight has got such a such, such feeling, a, such, feeling, so such feeling, a unique yeah. perspective. It's incredible. There's so much feeling. In so much feeling. Tonight. It's a cliche. But you know, I think that these guys are uh, almost, uh, almost, almost, done, almost, almost ready. ready to go. It's, oh. um, it's incredible. Cody, you were great, by the way. By the way, that's Cody. That was, Cody. That was Cody's backside, yeah. Fridge, having one of these hey, delicious ales. Hi. Hi. <laughs> hey, dude, how are you? Yeah, oh, you good. don't have a microphone. You're gonna, I'm going to have to sort of that's point right. my clock at you. Lean in. What's up? Do this. Yeah, yeah. What's up? Uh, we ran into you the other day at the. We ran into you the other day at the cafe, and uh, well, you, you were, were getting a coffee, I presume. Yeah, I think I was off cooking for someone. Oh, at my friend's brunch. I was, that was my first time leaving the house in months. I, I yeah, I like the brunch. You pronounce like the word. What is it? Tzatziki. I can never say it. You pronounced it perfectly, and then you said. No, that's not the way you pronounce it, but it, I think it was perfect. Yeah, I made hummus for the first time too. It was delicious. How do you make hummus, Cody? Tell ever. us. I, I crushed some chickpeas up with some garlic, some lemon. Um, what else is in hummus? Somebody help me. Hummus was some hummus. It's amazing. Well, Cody, we appreciate you garlic. in every in every sense. Thank okay, you. Tom knows how to um, make hummus. I'm getting the word now that Liz Martin Band is ready, oh. and 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 Liz, I want to welcome you back to Surrey Hills Live. It's such an honour, honestly, to have you back a second time. How are you? I'm fan well, I'm fantastic. Um, it's so <laughs> nice to be back, Dean. It's so nice to. Uh, I haven't embraced going to pubs yet. I'm one of those nervous people, still quite nervous on the street. 
Fair enough. You call that 1.5 meters? That's not 1.5 meters. Are you crazy? You nearly touched me. I'm that person. Yeah. Look, I, I totally don't blame you. I, that is an absolutely valid perspective, and not everyone is into it. And, you know, to be honest, some people are being a bit blasé. You know, we'll see what happens. You know, I hope everything goes fine. I totally get it, you know. But anyway, um, that aside, uh, you've got some amazing stuff coming up as well because we, we, you're doing a music festival, or we're, we're collaborating yeah. on a music festival, so I hear. What's yeah. happening with the, what's the festival? So, uh, end of June, the 27th of June, 27th of June, um, there's a festival called Platform Live. So these guys from Wagga Wagga got funding to uh, do a, to make a stage basically. They got a big um, container, converted it into a mobile stage that could go from festival to festival. Um, and so they've been doing stacks of regional festivals. Um, the idea of the stage platform is that it's accessible, mm. so wheelchair accessible, mm -hmm. that they have um, exhibitions that work for different kind of folk. So they've had lots of sort of like sensory stuff, fluffy things that you can touch and get involved in. Um, and it's been amazingly powerful. Out to places, I don't know, that I've never really heard of um, in, in Western New South Wales. Of course, with COVID, it's kind of paused the whole thing. Um, and so like a lot of the artsy, artsy people, like us, they've gone online. So the festival will be online from about two o'clock in the afternoon. All sorts of people, um, performers, uh, they've got some videos, some uh, exhibitions, mm -hmm. some readings. It's moved from being a New South Wales based thing to an international thing. Mm -hmm. So there's a German element, um, lots of people across Germany um, performing as well as across Australia. Mm. So it's amazing. That sounds uh, so fabulous. We'll be, we'll be part of that. Great, wow. amazing, mm. that's beautiful. And, and so that the people can, can look this up, uh, what, what's the name or do you have a URL? Hmm. If you <laughs> look at it's <laughs> Eastern Riverina Arts, or okay. you can look up Platform Live, okay. or you can just look at Liz Martin. Great. And I'll yeah. have all the info there as well. And you've got lizmartin.com, right? Mm, dot au. Dot com. So lizmartin.com.au, you'll find all the details there. Mm -hmm. This sounds like an incredible festival. Mm -hmm. And I mean, like, hats off to those dudes, like, um, mm. you know, pivoting towards online uh, mm. at this, at this mm. crazy time. And I cannot wait because, I mean, for me, it's like another thing. You're coming back to the, the basement. We're going to do a live stream from here. And I get to hear you guys one more time, which I'm so excited about. And I want to stop talking because the thing I most want to do is hear the Liz Martin band, the whole band. I'm so excited. Woo! So um, we're just going to, we'll, we're going to play Platform Live and then our EP that we released not too long ago. Around now we were thinking of, um, we were looking at touring the South Coast and stuff. So we're going to play you the, the EP that we put out a couple of months ago um, from the beginning to the end. Oh, and, yeah. Thank you. That's so cool. And uh, hopefully you enjoy it. So. Yeah. Woo.
it's next level cool.
Yeah. Wow. Super smooth. And seven days later, still not with me. One in two all those in favor of them. And you cry and so bury the
There's a song about a vampire. So this song, now that it's too late, it's basically, you know when you just gave your heart, gave your heart away, and then just that little bit too late getting to the party, just that little bit too late, this is that song. <laughs> <laughs> so cool. Now, now that it 
Is it there? Is it there, Tim? It could pop up. <laughs> there it is. There, there, there it is. is. There. Keep musicians yeah, at work. Throw in the price of a couple of beers. That'd be awesome. Thanks very much. Oh, Liz. Thank, thank you, thank Liz Martin. So band. Much. The band. Thank you, band. Thank you, band. Woo. Wow, wow! It was it, like it's just hearing that that material with the band. It's like a level. We should of introduce the band. We should, we should definitely yeah, introduce yeah. the band. Yeah, it's who we, we got we, here? Who's here? Who's here? Say hi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They don't have mics. No, that's okay. No, if you want to do it. <laughs> yeah, come on, Liz. Like, like, who we got? who's in the Liz Martin band? You we guys have, are so special. Uh, well, let's let's start with the the bottom end. Let's change up. The drums. We got Mr. Ruben Alexander. Yeah, yeah Ruben. Yeah, Ruben. Yeah, man. Whoring himself, whoring himself all night. <laughs> On bass, we have Ms. Michaela Davies. All right, Michaela. <laughs> uh, on guitar, like no other, Mr. Dirk Krutoff. Yeah, yeah Dirk. <laughs> well done, man. Beautiful work. And on the musical saw and other wonders, such as the violin and good spirit, Mr. Michael Bridges. Yeah. Hey, Michael. Thank you for coming back again. It's been yeah. such a delight. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, you so much, Thank Liz you. Martin. And, uh, and, Liz Ma and Liz Martin. Yeah. yeah. Liz Martin. The Liz Martin. Yeah. So cool. So cool. Wow, Rob. Wow, wow, wow. And I oh, mean, nice. oh, wow. 
like, oh, you know, I, I, again, I, mm. I feel like I'm just saying that, but, you know, it's, it, this is music that just touches you somewhere, like, very special and interesting and deep and amazing, and oh, Michael's violin and saw, that's a cosmic sound, man. Mm. It's cosmic. It is. It's such a pleasure to have them here and uh, to have them back again with the, with the whole experience. The uh, Dirk on guitar and the Kayla on bass and then Ruben with the beautiful fills on the drums. It's just a, just a magic sound, magic sound. And uh, get that EP. It's a gorgeous EP. It's so well produced and so, such a good sound. Um, but... Best show ever, man. Yeah, that's it. It's just... I'm, I'm still, I'm still but, kind of... I've been doing the sound. I'm a little bit... Oh my gosh, that was great. It's, it's you're like um, you're on a little high. It's like I'm oh on a bit God, of a like, high. What, I'm on a bit on? of a high. That was yeah, beautiful. Totally. But we have yeah. Mick Daly, the one and only Mick Daly, uh, a touring legend of Australia, one of one of my favourite songwriters. Um, I constantly walk around town with Mick Daly songs in my head. <laughs> is anyone? Is that happened? It's happened to a few of us. And <laughs> uh, it's it's such a pleasure to have him here and um, it's going to be an epic epic set they're sounding huge so uh what are we going to do while these guys set up have we got, well have we got rob video? uh i do believe that we did go into the wonderful world of rugs uh, this week <laughs> if you know what i mean did you <laughs> do you know uh, what i mean rob? i do yeah do you know what i'm talking about rugs. Oh, we did. We're, so there's a lovely what rug kind of shop. Rugs? Well, like super high end, like Stella McCartney, like <laughs> amazing rugs. Because there's this fabulous couple who have uh, have moved to Surrey Hills. Uh, I don't think quite recently. And these guys are. They we had actually had them in the studio uh, earlier. And I'm just like, oh my god, these are the most glamorous people in Surrey Hills that I know, right? So um, <laughs> it's like Ollie and Maxine. Did you have a video? Did you make we have, I'm about to throw oh, to a great. video, yeah. but I'm just, I just want to give it a bit of context right here. So, so Ollie and Maxine, uh, they have this fantastic gallery, um, uh, which is also a retail store uh, on Crown Street in Surrey Hills called The Green Room. And uh, what's amazing about these guys is they are super, super glamorous. They're from London. They're also a husband and wife DJ couple. They like DJ like all around town. They've been doing amazing like live streaming DJ stuff like in the lockdown. But they've got this fantastic gallery and they, um, they, they have these super high end rugs. But they've also got these gorgeous accessories that, you know, even the likes of me and me and you, Kathy, could probably afford. You know, they're wow. really nice, beautiful, stylish things, uh, and um, they're good friends of Surrey Hills Live. And Rob and I were down there on the weekend. We caught up with Ollie, uh, and uh, we we checked out their uh, their store. Uh -huh. And um, you know, look, this might this this is actually quite interesting uh, when you hear what what's what's going on in the store. And uh, Timothy, uh, who's taken my duties on the desk, you notice as well, by the way, as an aside, I'm. No longer Dean of the Desk. Dean of the Couch. Dean of the very comfortable couch <laughs> with uh, a very delicious uh, beer right here. Uh, so I'm very privileged uh, that, to have uh, Timothy uh, taking over my desk duties. And uh, one of the, the other amazing things that Timothy's done today is to cut this fantastic uh, piece that Rob and I did uh, on Crown Street. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's check it out. What do you reckon? Should we do it? I want to see these it. rugs. Check out the rugs. A world of rugs. Well, I'm going to go in uh, to the green room and chat to my dear friend Ollie um, about some of his fantastic new rugs and, and, and merchandise. Um, and we're going to talk about some music because Olive uh, by night is, is one of Sydney's greatest DJs with his partner Max. Max and Ollie, fantastic, fantastic duo of DJs. We're going to talk about music and Surrey Hills. Uh, so yeah, come on in. How you doing? Ollie, our dear friend from the green room. Welcome to the green room. Yeah, we moved in as a uh, pop-up space in October last year. Actually, this was the first place that I drove past when I landed from the UK. And I was like, this place looks really, really interesting. So we contacted the landlord. We were in here like three weeks later. So we have the sort of showroom, uh, the front showroom here. And then coming through here, we have our design studio, which is kind of where all the action happens. We looked at a lot of areas for this showroom, but I just really feel at home here. There's a lot of characters in Surrey Hills, for cool. sure, yeah. 
And this is such a beautiful space. So Ollie, um, can you tell us, uh, have you got any great new stock in here? What's new? What's new in store? Yeah, so these amazing new cushions. It's a collaboration with an English designer called Luke Edward Hall. Okay. Alphabet Cushions, which is a collaboration with a, a decorator called Sue Timney. And they come in every single letter of the alphabet. And we've got M and O, Maxine and Ollie. Yeah. We actually probably could have our DJ name, which is Maxology. Oh, it's yeah, our sort obviously. of double life. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we've been doing some sets for radio stations upstairs. So we have a full okay. sort of DJ setup upstairs and we've yeah. been doing sort of streaming from home. Great. Um, and we were just really looking forward to things reopening. Uh, we have had a great chat with uh, Ollie at the Green Room. Um, and thank you very much. Sure, yeah, see, you see, you see you soon. Thanks. <laughs> I want to run my hands through them. Kathy, I, I want to. I've been meaning to ask you about rugs for, oh. for quite some time, okay. actually. Um, would you Would you get a rug like that? Yes. Well, I, yes. I just need a bigger house. <laughs> do, do you know what I loved about that was? Did you see the shot of the dog on the rug? It's like, oh my god! It's like I feel like that rug needs to come with that dog. Yes. Yes. Because the dog and the rug, it's like it's, it's like a it's like two two thing. furry things perfect for winter. It just so <laughs> good. <laughs> so I can see myself like lying on the rug with that beautiful like what, what kind of dog was that? Like a whippet or something? Like it's yeah. like oh, I love the whippet. It's a beautiful rug. So. No, it's, it's gorgeous, and there's so many lovely businesses around uh, this yeah. area that, that, that just really, you know, uh, you know, it's so lovely to stroll down Crown Street or any other street. Oh, to hear that? But you know what? I am just really, uh, I'm amazed by this. I feel like tonight is the culmination of everything we've been building up for for yeah. the last, like, you know, 11 weeks. Mm -hmm. we've, we've got these three amazing bands. First time we've ever had a drum kit in the house, mm -hmm. and uh, it's not just gorgeous. No, it feels amazing. It feels... It feels, um, it's special. It's very special, isn't it? It feels very good. And I just cannot wait um, to hear this set because, um, you know, it's Mick Daly, man. The guy's Daly. a legend. We the all have his songs in our heads. <laughs> we have his songs in our heads and in our consciousnesses. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's amazing. Well, these dudes are like tuning. They're well, almost ready. They're, They're already ready. tuned. They're almost ready. It's uh, it's looking incredible out there. And um, and I'm also enjoying a lovely lager. I mean, I feel like we, we're trying to give um, a lot of love to all of the local breweries in mm -hmm. Surrey Hills, but this happens to be a Four Pines Indian Summer Ale, which I'm finding quite delicious. Now you're you're a teetotaler. You're a non-drinker. I'm a non-drinker. Yes. But you can feel the positive energy that the beer is bringing yes, into the room, yes. even as a non-drinker. Uh -huh. We all appreciate Everyone that. Everyone is having a really good time. Exactly. And, and who was that lovely man who dropped it off like uh, just before the show? <gasps> Do you know who that was? That was Luke Pegler. Okay. And I've known him for years because uh, he uh, he's a very fine performer, actually. He's mm -hmm. an incredible actor. Uh, very accomplished actor. And we met uh, on a film I was directing back in 2004. Um, oh, wow. Which was yeah. lovely. And... Um, He's a very, very lovely man, very fine uh, actor and uh, and a gorgeous gentleman as well. Yeah, so. there he was, popping up with the case of beer. I'm like, oh, who's no. this cute guy? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he's young. Well, exactly. Mm. That's right. He hasn't aged a bit in either. You know? <laughs> he's not aged. He's literally not aged since 2004, I think. Yeah, I hope. It's the I last think, time we worked together. I think they're always ready for us. he's not aged a drop. I think we're getting the, uh, I think, Kathy, we are getting the signal we're getting from the, the signal. floor. We are getting the signal. How's I think. the floor doing? Uh, we, we're doing good. Uh, let's cut to the floor. Let's 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 surprise him. Hey Mick. Oh. Hey Mick. How you doing, Mick. buddy? I think I'm good. Very so good. So good to see you, my friend. You Thank you so much for coming by. My pleasure. My pleasure. Oh man, I'm thrilled. Should we have a big applause? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. That's it. Mick, mate, it's a pleasure. <laughs> I can't wait for this. What are we starting with? I need dollar ring. Oh, I love this song. <gasps> yes. Am I, do I go? Yeah. Just, just go for it, man. Yeah, go. <laughs> yeah, go. <laughs> Each other. 
probably still do Talking in the kitchen of a gin and tequila after two Yeah, there's that other girl Oh, I see is you I'm sleeping in the same bed as a pretty nice Thing to do We were a lot younger then you were just a kid, but you always had that self-possession, at least I thought you did. In my imagination, I can still see that thing. Hey, have you still got the dollar ring? Out in the back lawn, slow dancing, this is where the party is Looking at you till you told me to cease and desist All these years later, I can still feel the stain Hey, have you still got the dollar rain? Talking good old loud, Wayne Wright the third. This is our time now, do not disturb. That crazy one out there, squawking like a bird. Don't you believe all you heard? You used to give me all kinds of reasons to sing. Hey. Still got the dollar ring. We don't talk on the telephone Sometimes when we're talking I wish we'd never run Someone on the bus once told us we look good together Here and then we knew it wasn't gonna last forever And now you're still giving me all kinds of reasons to say Hey Rib Alexander, Michaela Woo. Davies. Oh, 
more slowly Your every breath will be holy As your reward That is your reward
That's one of the ones I have in my head walking around. Yeah. Raise your... <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. That's, that's an epic. So special vibe. Oh, fuck yeah. Well, it's been a great night. It has been a great night. <laughs> I'm sitting here on the couch, loving these people playing. It's getting greater by the second. Thanks for coming in, Mick. Yeah, appreciate it. Yeah. This song's called Things I Remember, Things I Forget. <laughs>
This is a song called Second Century. The tune up was that called? Yeah. Probably had a tune after that. Bit of slaughter. Uh, song called Second Century, written about a love affair at the turn of the century. The most recent one, I guess. <laughs> it's a pleasure to be swapping spit with all these other great singers. Cody, Tom. Sanitized, regularly right. sanitized. Reg regular sanitization. Of course, no, seriously. <laughs> there's, there's five litres of sanitizer in this basement. I'm not joking. Nick, this is amazing. It is Ruben, incredible. Okay, this sounds incredible. Thank you for, having Thank you for right. coming. Thank you guys. We just had a couple of rehearsals and it's been good fun. Mm. Yeah, I went to one. It was <laughs> sounding amazing. What's coming up? What are we going to hear? What are we, oh, we going to hear? Second Century. The, uh, Second Century. Sorry. Yeah, the Intergenerational Love Affair. Fantastic. Cool. Edgy. <laughs>
Where's Cody? Cody! This Cody, is my get, version of, that, of, the, Cody? of the great uh, Cody, get story down of the here. great era of the fridge. warrior. Can we get it? Yeah. See, uh... Sing 
Hunter's name, the white guy that uh, is alleged to have shot Cody. This could be about him. Okay. So, John, really Cody's, Cody's not on, on mic, so it's John McIntyre.
killed his constant Charam page. Tell the copper stopped him with a shot from a 12 gauge. A farmer in his tractor saw the show down in his paddock. Man, they blew the killer's head away somewhere back in Morty Alley. Today, the killer's story has remained untold. He was buggered by a priest. He was just 13 years old. His motor stopped a ran died. Well, Chester didn't try, and the boy was more dead than alive. That's the way they buried. What is it? Ruben. It's called The Wolves of Adelaide. Ruben, Michaela, Liz Martin and the Fabulous Fabulous Band. Woo! Cody and Tom, you guys from Music for Trees, Rob and Dean. Thanks, Thank dude. you very much. We're going to play a song called, uh, it's a new song, it's called Wolves of Adelaide. New song. It's actually, uh, there's a lot of metaphors involved in the song, but it comes down to a, an incident when I was about 10 years old at Adelaide Zoo. Walked up to the uh, wolf enclosure where there's a lot of people gathered around. This particular wolf decided to take it upon himself to try and tear my throat out. And he picked me out of the crowd and I was quite, uh, uh, so we say flabbergasted by that. And it stuck with me and uh, probably gave rise to a few metaphors which are present in this song.
Sherry Hills Live, we love you all. I don't know. Step into the frame. Mick, thank you so much for joining us, buddy. We're, we're so grateful for all that love, all that. Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing. Um, <laughs> Hug everyone in the room, Dean. It's all right. Hug everyone in the room. Is that, is that legal right now? Is this mic yeah. even on? I just wanted to bring up the amazing artists that have joined us this evening. I do want to hug everyone in the room. Uh, we, we, we got audio on this mic. Uh, let's bring up the Liz Martin band. Liz, Liz, Liz Martin. Amazing. Thank you so much, Liz. Liz! We are, uh, you know, I mean, like, Liz, you're one of the the artists that, that's joined us from the early days, and, and Michael as well, and everyone else in the in the band. Uh, you know, during this time of the lockdown, um, I think it's been like a super cool, important like thing to do to just make sure there's live music somewhere. And um, hopefully we're pretty close to the point where live music will be live in a pub. But we have filled the gap and thank you. You know, I kind of secretly hope that this kind of thing always <laughs> lasts as well. Because this is really cool. Yeah. It's very cool. It's such yeah. a nice way to perform. Mm -hmm. And at the risk of COVID, thank you. Oh, <laughs> safe. Like, let's do the, the, the elbow thing. I really appreciate that. And look, I've noticed as well, just from the comments, like people who wouldn't necessarily maybe even be at the Shakespeare or the, the Straws are actually tuning in to see local live music. So that's a good thing. And maybe we can persuade them out, you know, if we do. You know, yeah. But, yeah. you know, like we'd like to thank you to, because um, we've had the opportunity to play here twice now and we've enjoyed it uh, a huge amount, you know, both times. Um, in a world where we don't have the opportunity to play, you know, sort of anywhere else live. And we have you guys who have helped us to put on a show mm. and an audience who have sort of come in to listen to it. Yeah. Um, sort of in the room and out there in the world. So, oh, man. thank you. Oh, look, I, I feel like I, I've said, I've used this, yeah, like, I mean, round of applause, totally. You know, I, I, I've said before, I feel like a pig in shit, which is a terrible thing to yeah. say, but it's like, it's my studio, it's like on a Thursday night, you know, yeah. what am I going to do? Uh, to have you guys come around and, and do this and for us to share it with the rest of the world, it's like this most special thing, and we're so grateful, and um, yeah, and it was amazing. And I think we, we were saying, that, like, the last time we met was, like, at the Straubs, is that right? Yeah, that's right. So it was, like, not that long ago, but under different circumstances. Pre so. Yeah, so it's really nice to do the full circle and I have you guys February. in yeah. February. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's it. Oh, man, it's so cool. Well, hopefully it won't be too long till we're back at the Straubs. Uh, the Straubs is now open again, and... She had a lovely beer there on, um, oh God, I feel like every night I've been out at a pub. I it's had like, a wine there tonight. There was no social distancing. Uh, the yeah, well, Strawberry Hills Hotel, it's a beautiful venue, um, and those guys are amazing. And, uh, you know, they were a bit, you know, they were behind why we did this thing. So, amazing. I want to thank everyone in the room. And, God, can I we just go over here? Because, like, Ruben. Ruben. Ruben, Ruben, like, dude. Yeah, yeah Ruben. I tell you. Woo! You're, you're doing superhuman shit with these drums. You're sticking things through the cymbals. And, and again, the last time we caught up, we didn't, we didn't catch up that much, but I certainly remember shooting your kit because you're at the Shakespeare Hotel and you're doing amazing stuff with Tom. Uh, you know, dude, like, tell me more. That was great. This, is, this has been great fun. Yeah. Oh, man. Three, four gigs with, without going anywhere. <laughs> I gotta ask you too. Like, and it's, are, are, your are, week you, done. are you writing set lists on your dramas right here? Like, what is yeah, this on the drum? Yeah. That's so cool, man. Like, oh, really? Right. 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 Yeah, yeah. 
You are just a multi-tool. <laughs> Man, I mean, it's just this is insane. This is not. This is not the. This is, you're not a. Re, you're not the, your regular drummer, right? You. It's just a superhuman drummer. Amazing, man. Oh well, we really, really, you know, appreciate it. So thanks so much for coming. And um and Cody. Oh my God, Cody. Cody. Uh, we got to go. Cody. Come on Wall up, of Cody. fog. Co Cody. Cody Dillon. Come onto the stage, Come buddy. Because you're a stalwart. Again, you're you're one of Thank the you. folks that uh, was oh, with us from the beginning. Uh, I remember that beautiful set that you did at the Shakespeare Hotel, second week of Surrey Hills Live. Yeah. Um, and you've come back. Is this your third time here in the basement? Or second I, time? I don't even know. I, I couldn't even tell you. Um, Rob, is this my third or second time? This is your second time performing. Second your, time your fourth time here. Right. Long yes. time caller. First, so in between. Long time listener. First, yeah. sec, second time caller. Second time caller. Yeah. yeah that, well, I that love makes it. sense. I love coming here. I live down the road. I know, well, and we've told this story before, like, you Thanks know, you. I found myself at this amazing party, and then when I met you, you were like, oh, I had an amazing party. I was like, oh, that yeah. sounds like the amazing party I was at. I was accidentally at your party. Well, it was I, a hell of a know, party. It was just such a cool party. It was Mardi Gras, actually. Yeah. It was a great, great Mardi Gras party. Um, so no, cool, we, we love coming here. It's so special. We're, I'm with Liz. Like, I don't want COVID to end. I mean, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Really <laughs> That's a big paraphrase, <laughs> my friend. Like, I would just love to keep performing here. Obviously, no virus. That, that would be great. But um, it's so special, the, the atmosphere. And uh, it's very quiet in here. And you've got the sound dead. And so you can actually hear yourself. Mm. And, um, yeah, I was just sitting there watching the bands after me. So it's a real treat. So thank, yeah. you, thank you to the bands and for you for doing it. And oh, man. you provided musicians an income when there wasn't any. Yeah, well, I mean, look, we, we, we I mean, obviously, we, we, there'd be nothing for us to do if it weren't for, for amazing, beautiful music. Might be the like difference you. between me living in a caravan out the back of my parents' house on the Central Coast. So. <laughs> 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 you, John All right, well, you. Uh, you know, we've got the GoFundMe link up right you, now. I, I hope someone's on the GoFundMe link right now. Cause Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, buddy. Oh, I love you, John. Oh, look, I, I give you a, a big sloppy bag, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's so amazing. Cool. Amazing. Well, look, we're so grateful, man. And um, and you know, I, I want to. I also want to acknowledge Tom uh, Get because up here. Get up again, there, Tom. You know, Tom Hess. The, uh, yeah. the, the genius of Tom Hess. Um, I remember we were doing an interview. Rob was interviewing you in this in the Shakespeare only a few weeks ago, and you changed your look. Tell me about wh why. What's what's wrong with overalls, Tom? Man, I've been wearing overalls for the last fucking three months, so I thought I would put, you know, different top and tails on tonight. But Just why, dude? Like, uh, why? Uh, uh, not that I, I don't love your look. It's gorgeous. I, I've got a spare outfit. I think it's a little bit change right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, it's great. And, I mean, your stuff is so... It feels very personal. It feels, like, very... You know, you 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 put a lot of you. Uh, maybe that's just me, but you put a lot of you into you. Yeah, well, that's the songs. Yeah, that's what I like to do, and it's a pleasure playing with Ruben. Yeah, it's a pleasure playing with anyone. To be honest, Ruben's, ama <laughs> Ruben's amazing. <laughs> Look at it. You know, you know it's it, like you. It's he's fun playing with yourself at home, but. A couple of other people <laughs> help. Well, everyone loves playing with themselves at home, dude. But um, look, I, I would just like to thank all the other musicians who are mm. here tonight. And I've I've seen Mick Daly play so many times, it's ridiculous. But I've never had a front row seat like that. So that was quite awesome. Oh, man. You are my favourite. He's man. a genius. He's, he's the man. Like, really. He, he, I, Mick, can I can I get you to? I know you you you're very tired after that incredible set. Can you just jump up here with just one thing? Because because hey, I because I'm 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 one of the uninformed. I have not. Yeah, a, round, a huge round of applause for this dude. I actually haven't seen you play, and I am so well. I'm so glad I have now. But man, you bring so so much energy and intensity and incredibleness and. It just, it hit me just right, like right there in the guts. And like, dude, thank you so much for coming down, you know. Blame it on four pines. <laughs> <laughs> and, he, and, you, and you're very sponsor friendly, which is, uh, but, yeah. but man, I mean, seriously, like, I mean, you know, you, you're obviously a very accomplished, uh, you know, like dude of rock, a, a, a music, you know, amazing. Like, um, I don't know, I, I'm in awe. Like, can you give me, give me some magic words here? Uh, when you've played enough empty pubs for long enough, you can do anything. Oh, oh, yeah. oh man. But uh, you, you just, you just, it's like a fucking kick in the balls, but in a good way. Like, if a kick in the balls was ever going to feel like 
good, like, and positive and, like, nice, then that would be your, yeah. You know, gender neutral, Dave. Gender I enjoy, neutral. I enjoy playing Kick in the, music, so, you know. Kick in the... Man, listen, uh, Mick, it's su such an awesome privilege uh, to be in your presence playing music, and it's, it's amazing, and thank you so yeah, much well, for coming. Thanks for having us. It was a great, great set. Yeah. Great job. Fucking yeah, great. thank you, guys. Oh, look, guys, uh, and I want to give a, a huge shout-out to Rob uh, and, and Rob's incredible work mixing. Uh, first time we had a kit in here, and that kit sounded super hot and amazing. Yeah. And uh, beautiful well, work, man, for, on uh, there. Thank you for helping me out. Thank you. Ruben for helping me out with that because I was so nervous this morning thinking about the amount of sound that we were going to be generating here and the different artists and and Ruben was a massive help in bringing the mics and his mic setup is incredible by the way like that's another show altogether of content yeah. but it was a it was a it was a cool experience setting that up with uh, right, Ruben yeah, thank you thank good. you thank you everyone good. and good. It's, thank you thank you thank you thank you uh, it really has, it's been such a pleasure having all these great artists here Incredible and, you know, artists. my close friends and um, it was beautiful. I was so, I was so, uh, you know, I don't know. It was a great show. So thank amazing, you. Thank you, everybody. Amazing. Yeah, well, yeah. Uh, you know, to, to the viewers at home, uh, thank you for tuning in. Uh, you know, we don't know what the future of Serial's Live will be, but we certainly hope to be coming at you with more live music for many weeks to come, hopefully many months to come. You never know. Uh, but um, I feel like that's that's kind of that's, I think that's, that's it. what we've we got. have to wrap uh, at some so point. <laughs> thank you all. Uh, if, if you guys want to chip in the cost of a beer to local musicians to keep this live stream, you know the link. Uh, otherwise, fingers crossed. We'll see you next week. Thank you so much. Good night and good luck. Yeah.